Hi everyone, welcome to this video on spaghetti squash. This one is very, very simple, but highly useful. I'm Jenna Edwards, your cooking companion. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Okay, let's get started with the recipe. We're gonna start by cutting it in half, and like with any winter squash, this squash is stubborn. So be very careful as you're cutting it in half long ways. Only cut it long ways like this. Once you've got it in half, you're gonna place it on baking sheets and bake it. I did mine at 400 degrees for about 40 minutes. You may want to roast it less than 40 minutes or less than 400 degrees, just depending on how al dente you like your spaghetti squash. However you like your spaghetti pasta is how you will like your spaghetti squash. I decided to do a little experiment here and see how a squash roasted facing upwards versus facing downwards. So as you can see, it looks like my squash facing upwards looks a little drier than the squash that roasted facing downwards. Now here's the really fun part. All you do once it's cool enough for you to touch or you can uh, use a, an oven mitt is you take a fork and you run it sideways. I at first thought that I would like the softer squash, but as it turned out, when I added the sauce, it became way too mushy and I preferred the consistency, the texture of my more al dente spaghetti squash. So play around with this and find the squash how you like it. There's a lot of room for flexibility here. Again, this spaghetti squash can replace literally anywhere you're using regular spaghetti except for maybe in cacio e pepe, but anything with a tomato sauce, a spicy, especially a spicy tomato sauce, anything with meat in it like bolognese or a ragu, it's fabulous with spaghetti squash because the squash is slightly sweet, so it can carry spicy or heavy flavors. This is a wonderful side dish or pasta replacement to have in your back pocket. Again, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Ask me questions or tell me how you used it in the comments. I'm Jenna Edwards, your cooking companion.